about spring and how we're into it now, but more importantly, we've had some great weather the past couple of days in the greater Boston area. And I've been watching the leaves kind of bud and the tulip blades push up through the grass. It's been fantastic to watch. And I was thinking about spring and how things are blooming, but like all things, nothing blooms forever in nature. Um, I was listening to a podcast this morning and they expressed that. So I thought I would expound on it because it actually has a lot to do with the process and selling and real estate. Um, sometimes you have to put in the work in between seasons, right? So we've got fall where you need to do work, winter, you know, things have to go dormant and spring things have to work. And then summer, you got to withstand the heat to get through to the fall. Um, so, you know, I think that it's a good analogy for sales and doing the work. I read a meme on the internet a couple of weeks ago that I thought was excellent. It talked about gold medals and how gold medals aren't really made of gold. They're made of sweat and sacrifice. It being spring, um, you know, it's the same thing. That little tulip does all this work underground and then pushes up through the frost once it gives way and then you get to bloom. Um, in real estate sales, you know, you really have to do a lot of behind the scenes work, whether it's learning and honing your presentation skills, learning how to deliver a listing presentation, uh, working on your CMA skills and valuation skills. So I'm gonna share with you today, uh, there's a web webinar on the 10 commandments of a listing presentation. Some high level agents are gonna be given that at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Hope that you get to uh, put some work in so that you can bloom this spring. We'll talk to you soon. About spring and how